I'm a dwarf, I'm not supposed to think hard on anything but how to get gold. So he reaches for the girl, and then the prince comes rushing at him, so he turns and runs and jumps over the wall. Hold on, let me double check that. Car, uh... They saw something rush through the roses and jump over the wall. Over. Not on to. Over the wall. Wow. I think, uh... I think we should stop looking into this. Why? Scared? Well, uh... I thought, pirates I thought droids are supposed to be fearless and not afraid of anything. There are some things in this world like that dragons. even you don't know of that would rip you to pieces before you even laid eyes on it. There's some things in these voids, this void that you don't know of, and if I tell you, you are probably going to run in fear. I'm not saying that I wouldn't. I'm not exactly 100% made of steel here. I'm pretty, uh timid when it comes to things out out of my ability to deal with such as something that can jump over walls that are as large as my own my own home is in danger here because of this thing and it probably knows that we know of it now it's probably watching us this very second but here's the thing it's this happened long long ago because John Oxide died just maybe a month ago or a year ago and he was about 10 years old when this happened and he was when he died he was maybe around 50 or 60 years old I don't keep track of his age so still if what if it's this still out was, there it could be dead by old age or a hiding away in some dark cave. Oh, wait. It jumped, but it came back. For it did. the princess. Why her? That's the question. Why her? Well, a little girl, all alone in a big castle with nothing but her brother. She must get lonely after a while. She's also young, so she's gullible. She doesn't, she's so innocent, she doesn't know the evil from the good. She thinks all is good. Hmm. Why a rose garden, though? Could have been anywhere else, but why a rose garden? Well, first off, this is the only place that somebody could actually hide. They can't hide in the water, or somebody could actually see them. This is the only place in the whole, probably whole entire garden, or place to be completely hidden. Look at if me. this thing's so powerful though, why would it need to hide? I guess it doesn't want to be spotted, it want, maybe its plans are for a secret, but at the same time it could so easily just go into her own room. Hmm. <sighs> so many questions, so little answers. I think that's all we need to look into, though. I, I'm, I'm telling you, Pirate, we don't need to go any further into this. We can stop right here, right now, and never look at it again. Turn our backs forever. Are you taking off our armor now? Nah, it was just getting a little heavy for me. I like to relax when I'm not having to fight. True. Why, Annie? Why does everyone cover up? What happened to the princess? There's a zombie in there. There is. It'll die in the morning. I don't know, but... <sighs> Here's the thing. There are... In the catacombs, there are three graves. Where is the grave of... Annie? And the news thing, where's the grave of the, their mother? 
Actually, maybe it isn't in the catacombs. Maybe it's behind in the graveyard. Perhaps. Let's go and find out then. No harm in looking, I suppose. Well, where, where are any of the other mothers? They're not in the catacombs either. Any of the queens, and not none of them were buried in there. It was only the kings. I guess that's why it's called the king's tomb, and not the royal tomb. But then there's that odd grave down there. Ah, uh, true. But it was empty last we checked. Oh yeah, they put this up for the people, so the people oh. could uh, make their regards. All right, let's break it down. Might be something underneath it. It's a, it's a monument, not a grave. Yes, but obviously evil people have odd ways of doing things. Fine. Uh, I'm not. Uh, yeah. I'm blaming this on you. If we get caught. Whatever. I'm a dwarf. They'll just have to accept that I dig holes. All right. There's nothing. There we go. Good as new. Except for that one piece of dirt. But the grass will grow again. I don't see any... I don't, I don't see any Annie. No, no, Annie. I, I, I found... Hey, I found the I found the other queens. Oh, there she is. There's one. There's two. Where's John? Where's John Oxeyes? Where's Annie? <sighs> what do you mean John Oxeyes? Well... He could have had a wife, mostly... I, I imagine a king would have a wife. Uh, whenever I came back, there was no wife. I came back a little bit... When did I come back? When did I come back? I know I left before the great massacre of the bounty hunters. That we don't talk about. And I returned... A little bit before you returned after the great armored race that already showed up, but then you no, came. No, I, I came before the armored race showed up. Uh, I don't remember you, but whatever, I'll take your word for it. I didn't really delve into anyone else's business, I was too busy with my own. Hmm. Just. Empty. You ain't digging up people's graves. It's empty. It's an unmarked and empty grave, and I bet you anything this one is too. Yeah. It's too. Yeah. Why would they cover up a princess? Was she, did she die, or is she if the princess is still alive? Oh. Ow. I got this. Stole my kill. You weakened it. What? Uh, turn what around. My eye. What? Turn around. Uh, hold on. I gotta, I gotta rip this arrow out of the back of your head. Oh. Hold still. Oh snap! Gah! Oh. All right, it's uh, I just broke off the other end. Um, we'll just we'll have to surgically remove the. The actual arrow itself in the back of your head, I'll, but uh, I'll ask my first mate to do that. It uh, it, sh it should it should get better, <laughs> unless you get an infect an an infection, then your uh, then your head's as good as your eyeball right there. Wow, insulting my eye. No, nah, just pointing out something. What? What are you pointing out? Well, the fact you're half blind. I'm not half. Insults everywhere. What? I don't know. Don't well, I dare just... see that gold block up there. This is a touch, Pete's sake. Oh, I didn't even notice the gold block. I was more thinking of what it represents. Well, this is a touch for God. There's a cross. No. Let's see. 
Let's think here. Oh wait, so, hey, look. I remember when they put these in. This one over here is the stained glass for the elves, and this one over here is the stained glass for the dwarves. That's supposed to be your mountain. It doesn't it doesn't look that well, but I can clearly tell it's a mountain though. Hmm. 